Pat, Pat love with Pat's two cents. The way some of us are, we, we look for the bad boy. We look for the bad girl. There's something sexy about that, sexually alluring. But guess what? The sex doesn't, <laughs> the sex doesn't hold a relationship. Sex is not a glue. Sex is the cherry on top of the cake. Not all the stuff that holds the cake together. And we get it backwards. So when we find out, when we start pulling that, we, you know, we start partaking of the cake after we have enjoyed the cherry. We find out that there's mold in there. That there are rancid areas, that it has gone so bad it really needs to be thrown out. But some of us don't throw anything away, do we? We hoard even those things that are destroying us. So you become hoarders of contempt, hoarders of abuse, hoarders of malicious. Oh, I don't even know. Oh, hoarders of humiliation, hoarders of shame, hoarders of frustration. Hoarders of needs that never get met. you got a pile of them. They never get met, but you hang on to them in hopes. And that's what you hoard too, the hopes. Yeah, the hopes that this other person that you have paid homage to all these years will one day wake up and realize what a wonderful person you are. Well, listen... I'm not really dealing with relationships, believe it or not. What I am dealing with is, why would you spend your life bleeding out your whole life source, your energy, your everything for a copper penny when God has real gold and the real gold is free of charge? The real gold doesn't have any strings attached. You don't have to put out to get a little nugget. You don't have to allow me to treat you like trash to get a little moment of joy. God will freely give you joy, love, peace, Comfort, healing, freedom, life worth living, favor. Ah! Okay, I'm stopping. Turn to God. Seek him while he may be found. Let the wicked forsake his way and the unrighteous man his thoughts. Go to God. He is waiting with open arms, with bated breath. If you only knew what you were missing. Because once you get a taste of the real thing, I'm out of here. Because once you taste his love, you will finally love yourself way too much to put up with that crap any longer